Hey, what's going on guys? Henry Kaminsky here from UniqueDesigns.net with another daily gem for all of you. Today we're going to talk about brand relevancy and an old saying my mom used to always tell her girlfriends and tell all the people that uh, she used to make laugh and, and, and just create this presence, right? So um, I had a funny, funny experience a couple weeks ago. Um, I had a gentleman reach out to me on Facebook and he wanted to learn a little bit more about my story. He found me on, on, um, on one of my daily gem videos and was like, dude, you know, I saw the video on your website and it was really impressive. I, I would love to, you know, pick your brain. And I hate when people say that, but anyway, that's a, that's another daily gem for another day. But, um, anyway, uh, we got to talking and he was in the branding space himself, right? So I thought, and so he was talking to me and he kept rattling off about how impressed he was and he loves the content that's I'm putting out and all of that stuff. I said, all right, dude, enough about me. Um, what about you? Tell me about you. I explain to me where you're at with your business and what what is it that you do? He says, well, you know, I help businesses, uh, you know, brand themselves kind of like what you do. And I was like, all right, cool. So who have you branded so far? Um, and he was like, well, that's kind of the thing. I, I haven't really branded anybody yet. And I was like, okay. I said, well, what's your website? Let me go check it out. And he was like, well, I, I kind of don't have one yet. And I'm just kind of starting out. And my like eyes like opened up. I'm like, wait a second. You're positioning yourself as a brand guy, but you haven't branded anybody yet. And you haven't really branded yourself. I said, when did you start? When did you get this idea? He was like, well, you know, a few months ago, I, I, I found, you know, uh, Russell Brunson and I was really impressed with the ClickFunnels community. And so I said, you know what, this would be a great idea. I could use ClickFunnels to like get people to like get to know who I am and uh, I, could, I could be this branding guy. And I'm just like, oh my God. So I was like, all right. And a lot of you guys know me already. Like I try to be as polite and as tasteful and professional as I possibly can be, but I had to give it to this guy straight, right? And so I said, do I have permission to, to give you a piece of advice? And he said, yeah, absolutely. Like go for it. You know, that's why I reached out to you. I wanted to pick your brain. And I said, my mother used to say this saying all the time to her girlfriends, God rest her soul. She used to say, been there and got the t-shirt. I've been there and got the t-shirt. And what did that communicate to her audience? It communicated that she had the experience already, okay? Which made it relevant, which made her relevant. Okay. So I said, if you're out there as a brand guy or positioning yourself as a brand guy, but you never branded anybody and you never branded yourself yet, how can you talk the talk if you haven't walked the walk? What makes you relevant to the people that need branding help? And you kind of, it was just like this awkward pause, right? And I was like, so here's my advice to you. Before you go out there and start spending money, why don't you get some experience under your belt so that you can be relevant to your target audience? See, the reason why people come to me for branding expertise is because I spent the last decade helping hundreds of entrepreneurs brand their businesses. And I've spent the last 10 years branding my business. And when they look at my past history, I'm talking about my target audience. They're like, that's what I want. 
I've seen Henry grow. I've seen his success. He documents it. He does what he says he does. And he's done it for himself and he's done it for hundreds of other people. I want that success. I want him to help brand me. There you have it. That's what makes me relevant, right? So I just want to stress for all of you out there who you know who you are, I don't have to call you out, that are that get a cool idea or get excited about the shiny object. Listen, I've been there. I went through that phase. Shiny object syndrome. Oop, squirrel. Oop, that's the next best thing. Oop, jump on it. Oop, spend three grand on this. Oop, spend three grand on that. I've been there. I got that t-shirt too. So my advice to you guys is if you want to dive in to an industry or you have a passion to help a certain individual or a certain target audience, make sure you get the t-shirt first before you pawn yourself off as some expert who doesn't know a damn about that topic or that industry. So for those of you guys that are looking for deeper help with branding and how you could become more relevant to your audience so people actually take you seriously, I recommend you getting a brand audit. I'll drop the link below. It's a 30 minute conversation with me one-on-one -on -one, and I will prescribe to you a plan of action that's practical and it will give you the direction that you need to connect with that target audience. So have an awesome day, guy. Hope you, I hope you get some value out of these. Please leave some comments, leave some questions below. And I will get back to you as soon as possible. Have an awesome weekend, guys. I'll talk to you next week.